uh, we have to spray and back roll all the walls in this three-story house. So I wanted to talk to you guys about back rolling real fast, um, show you guys some footage of how we do it. We're using an 18-inch roller, of course, three-quarter inch nap. Uh, this is my boss, Guy, and uh, he's a spray man today. I'm back rolling. And so first off, this, this roller is a little dry. It has a little bit of paint in it. So I'm going to be pre-wetting it um, before I uh, start to get going. And then once we get going, he's going to keep the walls wet enough that it, I won't do this anymore. So um, we're going to spray, spray vertical and well vertical, of course. And uh, he's got a four foot spray, spray pole. And I've got a longer, uh, longer extension poles um, that I might switch out to in a little bit. But, so we're going to show you some footage of how we do it. Four foot spray pole, because I'm only four foot tall. And I look a lot bigger on camera. I personally, I personally don't like to do the zigzag technique. Um, I, I learned the technique from an old school painter of uh, how to cover up my diagonal roll marks. And you'll get, you guys will see what I do is uh, if I'm headed from left to, to the right, I uh, start at the bottom, I, I fade my roller back and then I bring it straight down. I lift up the roller, uh, fade back, bring it straight down as I move across the wall. And I, all, the, all the tracks that are left behind are, are vertical. So this roller's been wet. We're going to start spraying on this wall. Are you here, guy? And this one right here, right? This one. We'll go, we'll go left to right real fast. Just getting warmed up here. He's using a 619 tip. The great goes 395 uh, sprayer today. And we're going to do one really good heavy coat on this spray and back roll. And uh, Sometimes we fog it afterwards and sometimes we don't, but we have the primer tinted, uh, tinted close to the wall color, so it's going to have really good coverage. And this is a new construction, it's a custom spec home, three stories, and it says orange peel texture. So if it's drying and it shouldn't be pushing any pressure whatsoever anyways. So uh, there's a couple quick tips for uh, back rolling uh, new construction. We are spraying the ceilings after the walls. Um, we'll be spraying those on Monday and Tuesday. So you guys have a, have a great day. Thanks for watching. Let me get this respirator on. Thanks a lot.
did uh, the basement so far. The roller's getting a little warmed up. We're getting the right amount of paint on the wall. And this back one's going easier. Uh, for bigger rooms, I'm actually gonna switch to a four to eight pole instead of this one, even though this works. So. And the ceilings will be painted tomorrow. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll be back rolling footage.